everybody. Uh, we are gonna get into the vlog, which is chock-a-block full of studio fun, but I just wanted to say thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring my video. Skillshare is an online learning platform that basically allows you to foster new creative skills or like fine-tune ones that you already have. And I think it's really important to continue learning like throughout your career. I literally got a creative degree and everything that I learned that has led me up to this point has pretty much been found online through trial and error or from other creative professionals. And that's exactly what Skillshare is. You're learning practical skills from creative professionals, from the comfort of your beanbag. Amazing. <laughs> I have a thousand two month free trials to give away of Skillshare Premium. So if you would like that, I don't know why you wouldn't. Link in my description. Skillshare is only $10 a month. I don't understand that. <laughs> I've been to creative conferences to see designers or artists or illustrators speak for hundreds of dollars. And the same people that are speaking at those conferences I've seen on Skillshare. For those of you that already have Skillshare or are doing the free trial, I will leave like a list of classes that I'm excited about here so that you have something to watch and enjoy and you can see what I'm interested in. Free trials in the description. I'll see you soon. Hope you enjoy my video. The trees and walls, they ever did talk. I'd be whispering the distance. Good morning, everybody. This morning, I'm getting ready because Rock and I are going on a day date. That means that we'll be outside. <laughs> Sorry, I can't talk when I do this. Boop, 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 boop. I woke up late, unfortunately, so I ruined our whole date day, didn't I, honey? I didn't ruin it. Well, Delayed. I know I delayed it and I don't want Rocket to think he's unimportant. I got a beanie. It's gonna be so cold I know a lot of you are not in the southern hemisphere. It's like pretty much winter here And the place we're going is gonna be minimum zero degrees Which is freezing and maximum of eight, which is still cold like I'm cold at 15 degrees Ugh, Someone else can do the conversion, but I got this puffy shirt. I'm wearing. I hope it's not too crazy Should I put some a little bit of color on my lips? It's not making that much of a difference Cool, I'm cozy, I'm ready. We're going on a date. <laughs> Woke up early just to see the sun. With every possibility, you're making all of me undone. Not so sure yet. What's in there? Nothing. POV, you're the only apple left in the crate. Can we do a full POV session of the cycle of an apple? <laughs> no. POV, you're popping off the tree. <laughs> POV you being eaten me? by the customer. <laughs> POV, you've been fed to the alpacas because you're a bad apple. <laughs> no, the POV would be this shot. Oh. It would be something like this, and then we'd be like, wow, look at these apples. <laughs> Do you want to get an apple bite? Yeah, I want an apple bite, and I want the toffee apples. Look, apple butter, wow. Apple jelly. Honey, can we, should we get both of these? We, we came just to buy apple merchandise. You come here. <laughs> can we get one hot spiced apple juice, please? Yes. Should we get a box of apples as well? Just love a good fresh apple. Oh, and they're pink ladies, my favorite. I can do half a box if you like. Oh, that would be amazing. Oh, Thank you. Part. You'd like an apple pie yes, as well? Yes, one please. Apple pie, yeah. One juice. Yeah. Toffee apples, Toffee. Toffee apple. an apple butter, Fidge, apple jelly, and a half a thing of apples, please. Oh. <gasps> Thank you. Wow, apple paraphernalia. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had hot apple juice. Once I put Coke in the microwave, it was not nice. But exactly. this is different. <laughs> this is one of the best things I've ever had in my life. It is very tasty. It's so good. I'm going to put cloves in everything when I get home. Alright, try the pie. Okay, this pie is freshly baked. I saw it come out of the oven. Look at it. Amazing. Is it not gorgeous? Oh my god. Mm. So good, hey? In the beach. On the backseat of my bike down a rainbow of emotion. I know we've been to Apple Ocean before, but if this is what they're all like, I will go again. No, I think this is a bit more bougie. So bougie. That drink is one of the best things I've ever tasted. And that pie was so fresh. It's the best apple pie I've ever had. That drink, I wish it never ended. Should we just get another drink right now for in the car? Yeah, I want Go and get 
Here, I'll get one. You get the one. shop's just there. You're back. I'm back. <laughs> Thank you. What'd you get there? I also got a muffin. Thanks. Do you have cold Oh ones? my gosh. This is the best. Baby. Who knew that hot apple juice would be delicious? And who knew that I loved cloves more than cinnamon? This is an almond. I almost ate a nut that I'm allergic to. You're not allergic. Well, I don't like them a lot. That's not the same thing. I want to live here. How do I get a job here? Do you mind going in and asking them what their secret recipe is for this apple drink? I like the framing. I look good. This place is great. Why can't we have a place like this in Sydney? The land space? I don't love muffins, I have to say. I think they're pretty good. You like muffins? I'll make you some. I'd love that. You love muffins? Yeah, muffins are great. They're a good, um, fulfilling, like, tasty snack. I don't find so. Walking sticks, that's really cute. Quick, Sean, jump. Pull one over. Gandalf here. You can pass. We accept everyone here. I'm going to be focusing on creating stuff to put into my store because it's been like a year since I last put stuff in my store and I think that's a little bit too long. I'll also be focusing on anything else I can do for the Bandits PR stuff, physical stuff, and then like start thinking about all the content that I can produce around the release, which is on September 29th. I just posted like a little sneak preview of the cover. It's kind of still has the indicator of where the UV will be, so part of the cover is covered, but you can see like basically what it is. So I'm really excited. I just don't know when to release stuff. The date that it comes out is in like three months. It just feels like such a long time away. So this took me ages. I don't know why, but I could not get the legs. I'm really happy with this and I'm just gonna start coloring it now. so I'm just charging it um, but in the meantime I want to have a look at old band tees because I have this idea where I want to make like a band style t-shirt for furry little Pete. half like release for my store half merch for like anyone that wants to buy it I just think it'll be so cute because band tees are usually like scary but I want to make like a cute one if that makes sense whenever I rep like t-shirts for my favorite bands I feel so cool like it makes me feel edgy even though I'm not <laughs> just like a weeklies meeting, which is very productive. I always feel pepped up after our weeklies. Got a lot of planning done for the store, but I'll just show you what I did yesterday. These were my sketches. 
Also, oh, I didn't show you guys this, but look, my stickers came! You remember the ones I did in the last vlog? They're here, look how velvety and pretty they are. Vinyl stickers are really good because they're very durable. Like, they can go on water bottles and they're waterproof, yet they can probably go even go on cars. And also they peel off, they're not like paper stickers where it leaves like a residue. It's like high quality and easy to remove. Look at them, I'm so happy. You guys saw what I did last time, what do you think? So this will go with the gift edition copies of Bandits, which will be signed and wrapped in time for Christmas and stuff like that. It's the Little Peach Gang. I just thought that was so cute, you know? And I really like it. Like, I would wear this for sure, and I'm going to. Ignore this. I was just showing Chris the live brushes on Fresco. And then here's, like, the vectored design. Rocket wants to get this embroidered on one of his jackets, so... Well, there'll be an edition of one of that. And then I want to do like white tees. I think they'll be pre-order because I don't want to assume everyone's size. Like I'd rather just everyone be able to get one. You guys would have seen this already, but I just want to explain. I wanted to do like tangelo season because tangelos are like one of my favorite fruits and they're in season right now in Australia. So it's just like a really warm sticker pack. Oh, I'm in love with this. Good morning, everybody. I just woke up. Yeah. The studio is a mess. We did some filming the other day. That's up there because of sound purposes. And I have a bunch of stuff to sort out still. Like I did do some sorting before, but I've got like, I don't know where to put my scrap paper. I need to clean this desk because I want to get rid of it. Like give it away. Cleaning sucks. Cleaning sucks. Yeah. Rocket says, I can't call cleaning a chore because we're adults. <laughs> to sort out. I have like a box full of scrap watercolor paper and I usually use it for swatch tests and like paint tests and maybe small paintings and stuff like that. See what I want to keep. I probably keep everything to be honest and then find a better place to keep it because it's just getting dusty and it's not going to be useful if it's dusty. Yeah. Oh, it's dusty and I'm allergic to dust. It's not going to be good for my skin. Stuff like this where it's just like scrap drawings. I can still use the back. I can use this stuff. There's these from like my October test. I can still use the back. I'm going to use this bubble mailer. I'm not sure if I'll be able to fit in the big ones. Oh, it all fits. How amazing. I can put it underneath that little cupboard over there. Ignore the rest of the rubbish that I have to deal with. No, it doesn't fit. It's so annoying. Let's see how it looks. Before I do the desk of doom, do I deserve to go and get myself something from a cafe? I think I deserve a cookie for doing my chores. restock because it was sold out and I wanted to get another one because mine was so dirty. I tried washing it, the stains are forever. This is gonna be my clean one and the other one can be my dirty one. Here is the stuff that Paper Smith sent me. Oh my gosh, it is so me. Check this out as well. Just different gridded paper. So cool. It's my favorite stationery store in the UK. It's and it maybe in the world. It's so well curated. I love it. I'm gonna try and put my tape into this new tin that I got recently from a 
antique warehousey thing. Bear tape, because it used to be made for tape. So I just think that's so cute. Some of you were asking about this tape. It's from this store called Flying Tiger Copenhagen or something. It's like a variety store in Tokyo. It's not very good. Like the dispenser is not heavy enough and the tape doesn't stick very well, but I can just use it for other tape, I suppose. I gotta, I gotta read you the flavor. <laughs> Ginger, cinnamon, black pepper, cardamom, clove, so coconut chai. milk. It's called the spicy ranger. Ranger. That's what it says, All right? Don't, I'm, I'm just the messenger. Don't you know that's um, a recessive gene? Eve's undoing, what which is doing? Granny Smith, Red Delicious, <gasps> a pink lady. What is this brand? Apples. When I woke up at six thirty this morning, Sean was still asleep, and I was just kind of like sitting there, and then I heard Sean muttering, and she was like. Constantly, constantly, I need more donuts. <laughs> and I always just laugh at I don't remember dreaming about donuts. I get some water because we should have just eaten donuts. Yeah. They're kind okay? of warm, yeah. <gasps> oh, they're nice. It's a big one. Do they make them to order? Well, they just like do small batches. Do you want to try this or do you want to save it for later? Let's try it. This is a spicy boy. Mm. Just for sure. I don't like it for me as much. <laughs> <laughs> what should we do now, today? Life. Are we working today? We're going to Mama's house tonight. What's wrong? It's just so many events. So what do you want to do? If you could do anything, what would you do? What's yeah. relaxing to you? Do you want to go for a drive? You don't have to go if you don't want to, if you're tired. No, I will go. I'm just trying to figure out. i got to edit photos. I don't know if you've seen my office right now. but Should we go have a meal or something? And then come back and do work. And you can set up here because your office is far. So it's pretty clean out here, you know? And I feel guilty because I haven't had a chance to do anything. And like you clean the house and I've just come Baby, in and like been non stop for two days. And Sweetie, now I'm you like always making clean. Making a mess. Well, I do that to you as well. Don't worry. I don't care about mess that much. I just clean for you. <sighs> That's wrong. What do you dream of doing? Do you just want to start, start your work there now? I don't really. It's the weekend, you know? You don't have to get photos of people tomorrow on Sunday. Yeah. Should we write a list now? Yeah. All right, I'll be a scribe. Can you tell me what you want to do? Edit the photos from Blockhouse. Blockhouse, and then we'll put all the tasks. Edit photos. Send them off. Upload to Dropbox. Yep, and then send invoice. And then what else do you need to do? You want to clean the office? Sketch thing for a secret project of mine. Secret? From me? No. Oh, okay. From them. <laughs> <laughs> Getty stuff. Oh, yeah. It's just so it's not forgotten and it's written down. Yeah. Writing some stuff. Oh, baby. Not bad. Baby. Not red. Just, just callous. Wash your hands and I'll moisturize. Let's go wash your hands. Baby, be careful with you. I am. The, uh... You know, you might get a pyogenic granuloma again. It's not that bad. What are you working on? I will be doing finishing my video, which I need help. Can I add audio to your list? Yeah. So you've had your outside time for the day? Yep. I haven't. It's okay, I can go for a walk. I will go together. No, it's okay. What we need to do is we need to have a little relax and I need to put my laptop on charge. Okay. I did a colour sheet a few vlogs back and that was for Together Gallery which was just to like kind of entertain people and get people through COVID and make people feel like a sense of togetherness and community while we had to be apart. Since then Adobe contacted me and wanted me to be a part of their Adobe colouring book project which is like every week they were getting like a certain amount of artists to do colouring sheets and I guess, oh can I have some one of those? Sorry. They asked me to contribute and I'm really excited because I actually really like doing color sheets. I find them really fun. And this one was about places and spaces. So I originally pitched these four ideas and I just made up a bunch of places. <laughs> and then they were like, oh, can you let us know which place this is? I'm like, oh, I just made it up. <laughs> I was like, I can totally redo this and like be inspired by an actual place. Because a lot of my work is like 
in its own world. So it was my initial reaction to just make something up. Luckily they were like, no, we really like it. Cause I presented um, this as the option. So I've done this and now what I need to provide them with is a colored version as well. Mm -hmm.